The Virginia women's tennis team ended the 2013 campaign with a loss to Texas A&M in the round of 16 at the NCAA tournament. The Cavaliers returned five players who helped the team advance to the Sweet 16 for the third consecutive season. I'm excited about this year's team. It's, uh, it's been a long process uh, for a couple of them, Chile and, and Carissa, really happy to have them you know, in, in this final stage because uh, they've put a lot of work in and, and now they're leaders and, and can hopefully, hopefully pull our team to a good position. But definitely a deep team, probably from one to eight, the, the, the closest and deepest and strongest level we've had. I feel like one through six will be very strong and I'm very thankful to be part of such a great team and a great group of coaches. The Cavaliers began last season with three tough losses to ranked opponents in the ITA national team indoors. The losses provided important lessons later in the season. We had a rough start, not, not necessarily by our level. We were playing well, but we lost to three top 10 teams, unfortunately here at home in the indoors and we lost by the narrowest of margins. You take all of the experiences and it's our job as coaches and as a team to play to win, do everything you can in that moment, but then also take everything you can out of those moments and, and make sure that you use it to the best of your abilities moving forward. Returning is second year Julia Elbaba. As a first year, Elbaba played most of last season at number one singles. This year she believes she can also help the team off the court. I'm trying to take a little bit of a role as a leader trying to take in what I learned last year into this year and you know helping my teammates out. I'm really glad this year I can go in with more experience and know what to expect each match. New to the squad are first years Rachel Pearson and Marie Foy. Also eligible is Danielle Collins, a transfer from Florida who enters the year ranked 28th in singles. The Cavaliers will host the UVA Winter Invite, VCU in South Carolina, before the ITA national team indoors at the Boar's Head Sports Club. Amazing, I mean, Boar's Head, the sports facility is incredible, and I mean, I'm so thankful that we get to host here. We get a great crowd, and nothing's better than playing at home in front of the people you love. It means everything. It's a great way for us to welcome our fans and play in front of our fans and kind of have a huge event. And, you know, win, lose, or draw, you get some great experience and you get to play in a national championships.